Welcome back to Yakuza Infinite Wild. It, it, so for me, oh boy, let me tell you, it's been like a month and a half since I last played this. For you, it's been a couple, a day or two. Well, I don't exactly remember where I left off, but when I do this, I might remember. Traveled to Injinsha. Injinsha. Yeah, it's been a while. I Uber Eats. That's an ad. Well, that covers everything, huh? Guess it's time for the big meeting. Yeah. Jinai Station. Let's take off from there. There's no turning back. I forgot what was going on. I kid you not. Uh... Oh! No problem so far. We're about to meet Daigo. Is there anything here that yells side quest? No. Well, um, actually there is one thing. I'm gonna eat and get my health up. I do not want to do whatever is about to happen without having full health. This is the closest restaurant we're eating here. Let's see, what do I want? We'll have a little, uh... Uh, how about... You... You... Nope, not you. And you... Thanks for buying. That was great. That food. food. You certainly food. Yeah, okay. So yeah, I, I actually have not played this for a month and a half. I just started playing a bunch of retro games and got really into them. Which, hey, there's nothing wrong with that, even though I wasn't. I am enjoying this game. But personally, gameplay-wise, way, 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 way better. Like a dragon. I love it like a dragon still. The, the combat system, way better. The problem at the moment for me is the story. The story right now is not hitting it for me. I hope it gets, you know, I don't know. It just. Some bits of the story are just. Like a dragon hit everything it needed to. Infinite Wealth, it's faltering at places. It's hard to explain, but let's go. Well, it'll be Kiri son. Ready to go meet Daigo and the others? Ooh, recommended level 41. No. Give me a second. What's my level? I hate to say it, we might be ready. Yeah, I think I over leveled. Uh huh. I am. Let's go. Roger, Roger. Yep. Okay, keep your guard up, everyone. Alright, time for a cutscene. I haven't played this for a while, so it might be a bit rusty. It's cold. How long have we been on the road? Hey, you could have always stayed back in Yokohama, you know. <laughs> well, maybe. If I'd have known we were gonna take the scenic route. No kidding. Still, Kiryu-san's probably better off with a friend or two. So there's that. Hmm. Agreed. Probably the only one that is fine with Namba, because that guy's wearing a jacket and a shirt and all that. Looks like it's gonna snow. Sorry about this. None of the taxis were willing to make the trip. Uh, no surprise there. Long distance is a gamble for them. You need someone who will hitch a ride back, and where we're going, those are few and far in between. Rare sight to behold, honestly. Not many people would want to go up this way. You might even be the first. 
How come? You guys work in television or something? No. Just visiting a couple of old friends. It's been a long time. I like Curious Jacket. I'm curious where this is going to go, because Daigo and all of them should have been keeping the Yakuza in track, in line, and help reform them. And from the past, we haven't seen things happen. The Second though. Great Dissolution is the only way to dissolve the remaining Yakuza groups within the country. Perhaps to Ebina, it's just a means to an end, but to Arakawa, it was his dying wish. Knowing that, I swallowed my pride and left prison to see it through. However, Ebina's has taken more control of the Seriyu clan than I could have imagined. He's got me under 24-7 surveillance, no matter what I do. I can't even be alone unless I take measures like this. If we're really going to pull this off, I need reinforcements. Hearing him ask for help is weird. Yes. That includes you, Kiryu-san. If you'll permit me to do so. Granted, I understand your situation's tricky. I can't ask you to step back into the limelight. Certainly not at the moment. Now then, this may come off as rude, but instead, I'd like to ask you a favor. What is it? Daigo Dojima, Goro Majima, and Taiga Saijima. Three of the most legendary Yakuza of all time. If anyone can help the second dissolution, it's them. You want me to ask them? Yes. I believe we need their influence in order to fulfill Arakawa's will, and rightly this time. After the disbanding of the Tojo and the Omi, its former members established a security company out in Osaka. It was a refuge for old Yakuza who'd lost their way. But for all their efforts, the company went under after just a year. Since then, Daigo-san and the others have disappeared. Well, sorry to say, but I don't know where they... But even if you can't contact them, you must have some idea where they might have gone, yes? <sighs> You're not the type to leave them alone for good. You're the only person who could drag them back out into the open. Please. I don't have anywhere else to turn. I do know that they disappeared. However, I'm not really sure why. So, guess we start from there. Sorry, guys. In case it wasn't clear, I'll be out for a few days. And that's where that left off. Okay. Mm. Old friends, huh? Gosh, these fellas must be pretty eccentric. Don't mean to be rude, but <laughs> no one in their right mind would live out there. No, sir. Who knows? I'm sure they've got their reasons. Reasons? Sure. Well, give it two, maybe... Three more hours on the road. Oh, there's that snow. Better bundle up, friend. <laughs> well, the truck driver seems cool. I'm expecting him to turn on us. I don't know why. It's just Yakuza games have a lot of people that backstab you. Okay, Sung He is definitely the coldest. She's just out here in a skirt. Unless those legs can keep warm. I'm sure you guys have a lot to talk about. We'll hang out here. Appreciate it. One thing. Maybe try to make it quick. The sooner we get out of this cold, the better. Sure. No, it may be a shack, but it's still home. 
Maybe try knocking. Little manners will go a long way, after all. Wow, Majima is in a sh just living in a shack now. <laughs> Shit. You're getting old, Kiryu-chan. Time will do that, Majima-san. <sighs> Kiryu-san. A lot's happened. <laughs> Guess that goes for all of us, eh? Yeah. Well, <laughs> grab a seat. Least we can do is pour you a drink. Haven't seen you since the dissolution. It's been four years already. Well. Last I'd heard, you had a security company out in Sotambori. <laughs> had. And hey, look where we are now. What about you, Kiryu-san? You doing okay these days? That is not the same yourself, English voice actor honest. from the last game. Actually, that's no surprise. I've got cancer. They gave me half a year. <sighs> you what? <sighs> okay. <laughs> Even the dragon, huh? Guess no one's safe. Guess not. Well, if you're short on time, might as well drink up. Doubt Hell's got a good selection. Majima-san, the man's dying for pity's sake. It's all right, Daigo. Might be crude, but he's not wrong. Better to enjoy things while I can. Long as I'm still here, I'll keep pushing along. Well, better not waste your time with us then. Fine. What happened to you? How'd you all end up here? Who cares about us? This is no place for someone in your condition. You need to be back in the city. I'll get you a car and... Daigo. Honestly, you think you'd learn by now. <sighs> you think Kiryu-chan here's gonna listen to that? <sighs> it's been so long. I'd almost forgotten. <laughs> really, I suppose this is just like old times. So, you wanna know what happened? Is that it? The world happened, that's what. We lost. Settle in, cause it's take a minute. Now, when we set up the company, we knew from day one there'd be risks involved. I mean, this happened right after we dissolved two major clans. How could there not be? We knew we'd get people's attention, especially since we were all former Yakuza. Knowing you, I'll bet you tried to mitigate that. Of course. Naturally, I tried to take every precaution possible beforehand. I used all our connections from both the Tojo clan and the Omi Alliance. Talked with the media and the higher-ups. Granted, most things don't come for free. Close to 70,000 lives were on the line, and the five-year ex-Yakuza clause would have swallowed them whole if not for that. I did what I felt was necessary. I'm not here to tell you whether you made the right choices. There's only one thing I want to know. Where did it go wrong? Well, things were great at the beginning. Gradual as it was, we built a fairly large clientele. I mean, plenty of businesses need protection. We had the men for the job. When it came to reintegrating criminals back into society, it seemed like we were doing just about everything right. All that said, after the first year, we started seeing some issues. Something with the employees come up? No. Online accusations. God damn it. <laughs> Popular Channel did a feature on our company. Thanks to that, to all of our ex-Yakuza employees were exposed. 
They even aired out the backdoor deals I'd made with the government and media. Hang on. This channel, it wasn't... The Tatara channel. Who else? Same one that hit Kasuga. And it wasn't just the deals. It was everything. They got their hands on every scandal they could find. They stretched the truth paper thin, and we ended up taking the heat. Maybe. But even with all the stretching, we still did what we did to get ahead. In light of that, there wasn't much we could say in our defense. Before long, our customers started leaving, one after another. Government boys washed their hands of us, too. Talk about heartless. From there, all eyes were on us. The world was watching our every move. We were at a standstill. And the company's finances dwindled as a result. It was then word broke out among the employees. The Yakuza life was calling them back. I mean, you got former Chairman Daigo up top, and we're right there with him. Ain't hard to see. If we wanted to start things up, we definitely had the means. Among some employees, there were even talks that we were planning to revive the Tojo clan. All sorts of rumors made their way around. The company was in shambles, and in such short time. <laughs> it's a miracle we didn't go sooner. Thanks to the Tatara channel, society wanted nothing to do with us, and those inside started longing for the old days. For their sake, we figured we ought to shove off. They needed a fresh start, and we weren't helping their case. I see. That explains why you're out here. If we really wanted to see the great disillusion through, this was the best way. That's what we concluded, at least. I think I get what happened. Do you know Ebina of the Seiryu clan? He took over the Great Dissolution once you left, at least on the surface. Yes, I know the name. I've never met him, though. Two years ago, we got a tip that he was out looking for us. Two years ago? That was right around when Takabe got locked up. That's right. Ebina replaced Takabe. It's more or less all he's known for. His name alone isn't enough to unite the Yakuza. Not on a grand scale, anyhow. He'd need a few poster boys, which is probably why he wanted us. Little did he know, that ship had already sailed. Yeah, that was part of it. However, there was something else that bothered me. <clears throat> the man was due for a background check. And what we found was odd to say the least. Ebina was raised by a single mother, but she died when he was in middle school. Afterward, his family name was changed. He became the Ebina we knew today, but the name he had before, it was Hikawa. Hikawa? Ebina's mother's name is Yuriko Hikawa. She's the Hikawa family patriarch's daughter. Hikawa family? You mean Masumi Arakawa's old family? That Hikawa? Oh. Correct. And did you know that Arakawa-san and this Yuriko Hikawa were once engaged? Right. Patriarch pushed the proposal on him, I'm pretty sure. Yes, but Arakawa-san already had a woman he loved. That was Akane-san. However, despite that fact, he couldn't just go against his own boss's wishes. And so, he kept a relationship with Yuriko-san as well. Now, this brings up a good question. Just who is Ebina's father? You don't mean... This is all just speculation, of course. But Masumi Arakawa may in fact be Ebina's father. I don't think so. Ebina is around Kasuga's age, give or take. Even their birth dates are similar. Okay, maybe. So Kasuga and Ebina... You're saying they could be... Half-brothers? We told you it was odd, didn't we? But if that's really the case, I can't imagine Arakawa would just abandon his own son. Judging from when Ebina was born, Arakawa-san must not have known about Yuriko's pregnancy. And after the Hikawa family all but collapsed, Yuriko gave birth without a soul knowing. From her perspective, Arakawa not only killed her father, 
He also abandoned her son, leaving them completely alone. I can only imagine the anger and spite she must have felt. And what if that anger was passed down to Ebina? Ebina does hold a lot of hatred for Arakawa. Exactly. So it's hard to imagine that Ebina would take up Arakawa-san's legacy. The second great disillusion was all the man ever wanted. So you guys kept your silence, and as a result, Sawashiro was chosen for the task instead. <sighs> yes, I believe that's the case. Yep, that about wraps it up. But hey, I'm sure you didn't come all this way for story time now, did ya? That's right. Actually, I have a favor I want to ask you. I want you guys to help out Sawashiro. As it turns out, he's trying to fulfill Arakawa's wish too. Bringing about the second great dissolution. Ebina's watching him like a hawk, like he's the Seryu clan's prisoner. If he just had your help, Sawashiro could step up and knock him off his throne. You all started it. The second great dissolution should be yours to finish. <sighs> I've said it already. There's nothing we can do. Come on. You don't have to like any of it, but at least pay attention. Kill you. Look, they're right. We got no business in the limelight anymore. I mean, sure, it's true we got the power to rally folks, and we can get them moving too. We join Sawashiro on stage, and we'll get the attention of every Yakuza in the country. It's called charisma. Nobody's stupid enough to say that for themselves, but hell if it ain't true. <laughs> How it goes. Slice it however you want. That's the Yakuza way. The dreams we ended up giving others, they're what keep them coming back. The Yakuza we knew was strong. That Yakuza had money. Those dreams ain't worth handing out right now. They need guys who can help them get back into the real world. No way in hell, that's us. Especially not with our recent track record. The moment we learned something was off with Ebina's history, we knew there was a lot to consider. Yes, there's a chance he's taking advantage of the second great disillusion for his own interest. However, if he pulls it off, who are we to interfere? If anything, we should keep our distance. Right. So this is how you're taking responsibility? It is. We'll act as if we don't exist the best we can do. Honestly, even death had its appeal at one point. But if we're dead and gone, our names will just carry on into the future. Kiryu-san, are you aware of what they all say? All those Yakuza. Do you know how they see you? Yeah, they act like you're some great mythical hero. If we ended up just like you, the illusions of the Yakuza life would be stronger than ever. Just look at your own life. Shintaro Kazuma was everything to you. And how'd that turn out? Sawashiro would sacrifice himself to take down Ebina. But that alone won't be enough to save everyone. He's counting on your help. Uh, I'm sorry. Fine. I'll be there for Sawashiro as best I can. You guys can just keep rotting away. <laughs> Guess I was wrong. Hold it! The hell's that supposed to mean? It's just as I said. I was stupid to think coming up here would change anything. Go ahead and run. Just remember that for all your excuses, you still have a job to do. know about what we've been through. You have any idea what it's like? 
No, I can't say I do. And I wouldn't want to. Damn you! What's wrong? If you want to fight, don't hold back. Boy, do I hate getting worked up over petty shit like this. Better than sitting around being pissed off, though. Sure, why not? Let's throw a few punches. For old time's sake. Hey, what's going on? Ain't you guys supposed to be having a nice, friendly chat? Cause, uh, they sure as hell don't look like one. Sorry for the wait. I'll need just a little more time. Quit acting so tough. We're not gonna leave our friend out to dry like that. <laughs> more importantly, if we stay out here any longer, we'll all freeze to death. Mostly you. <laughs> so you've got five on your side now, huh? Suppose that's fine. I'll just have to tag in, too. Ooh, oh shit. How about this? Never thought we'd be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with all three of you. <laughs> yeah, sure. Like you got any business with us. Maybe stay in your fucking lane. <sighs> oh well. Guess I'll try and make this fun. One express trip to hell coming up! After this. Hey, we can't back down now. We're locked in, sister, so buckle up. It's time. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, I shouldn't have done that. Give it all you got. I'm on a roll. Let's go. Nope, nope, nope. Give me a second. Actually, what can I do? Oh, throat slur. Why not? Try to block this. <laughs> I won't hold back. Have I summoned all of them? I got enough money. Ooh, you know what? Let's summon good old Akiyama. Our friend Akiyama. No benefits. Does he attack all? Okay, let's do it. This Delivery. Could this be what you're after? In that case, have a ball! That's a good attack. Oh. Uh, I'll just do mask of punishment. Get out of my way! Now it's Nope, nope, he's just gonna evade. Watch this. There we go. What's the holdup? Ooh. We're going to regret this. Alright, let's finish it. Together, we only need one Next. shot. I won't hold back. Grapple. Ah, there's grapple. Ready for the knockout. Ah. Here we go. 
Wow, he's out of breath. That did barely no anything. For now. I'll take you on. Have fun with this. Oh, damn it. Oh, I was doing so good. Let's go. Um, actually, uh, let me swap you out with. Yeah, swamp you with Psycho. Follow my lead. Let's do it. I could, and I will. It's over. their next turn. Oh. 
Oh, is she dead? Watch no this. ifs, ands, or buts about she dead. <laughs> Here's to a happy family. You're gonna be in a way. We doing it, babe? Bring it on. Special order. Enjoy. Give it all you've got. No begging for mercy now. I won't hold back. <laughs> Alright, I think Majim is done. Hope you're ready. Get serious. Try this on your side. Here I go. Fire defense is down. One for the road. Oh, what's they clicking this? Oh, is that how I'm... Interesting. Is that how I'm de gonna be defeating all of them? Actually, is, uh... No, it's just your fire spinning. He's done. Yeah. Give it all you've got. I'm ready to kick some ass. Have a shot. Huh? Out of my way. Now no begging for mercy now. Have fun with this. Alright, I think he's ready. Definitely ready. I won't go for that. Hope you're ready. I'll follow your lead. Poor Daigo. No time to hold back. I love that the arena is their path. Oh, bracelet of the four divas. Hey, I got my money back from the summoning of Learning more every day. So nice. <laughs> Doing better than I thought. Oh, Hell wow. yeah. Yes. <laughs> Sweet. Strong. Woo. There's more where this. All right, let's see where this goes. Also, their classes are almost done leveling. Yeah, well, they haven't been battling for Be four years, me. so it makes sense that we beat them. What are you all so afraid of? Are you scared of screwing up people's lives? <clears throat> or maybe... Maybe you just don't want to fail again. Whatever the reason... You'll never know if you don't try. You act like it's so simple. Say we do try. What happens if it all goes to hell again, huh? If that day comes, you keep on pushing through. As long as you're breathing, keep moving, 
keep trying and figure it out. There you go again. Always the hero. Say what you want. It's the only way I know. Besides, this is the last time. Anyway, I'm gone. You won't be hearing from me again. Wait. Don't go. Kiryu-san, I get that you don't have a lot of time left. Still, it's not worth it. That's no reason for you to run off and get yourself killed. You're wrong, Daigo. What? Honestly, it's a weight off my shoulders. My death's finally worth a damn. Kiryu, what are you saying? I'm the same as you guys. I've screwed up more lives than I can count at this point. Not to mention... I'm a Yakuza. I haven't exactly lived a life that I can be proud of. Yet even then... Through it all, I'm... Somehow still here. So that's it. The Yakuza have made a huge mess for themselves. Once I grab hold, I am taking it with me. You're talking out of your ass, Kiryu. That's no excuse to... Wait till things settle down. Come then, Kasuga's gonna need your help. The Yakuza have one chance. Their future depends on him. Don't you leave! Don't you dare leave! Kiryu-chan! <laughs> you know, it's funny. I came to ask you guys for help. But maybe... All I wanted was one last fight. <sighs> Wait, Kiryu-san. Well, we're back. And no Daigo Dojima, Taiga Saijima, or Goro Majima. Ah, oh, man. If they just get off their asses, we'd have wrapped things up by now. <laughs> You're probably right. <sighs> they seem to have made up their minds, though. It's not like we can force them to help out. You got me there. I swear. To think the Tatara Channel got a hold of them, too. Yeah. Hey! Oh, whoa! Isn't that Kiryu? Yeah, look! It's gotta be him! It really is! Uh-oh. What's going on? <clears throat> if we let this guy roam free, the Yakuza will just keep coming back! I don't care if I get locked up! He's never gonna hurt us again! We don't have time to take these guys on. Let's lose them and get back to Kasuga's place. <sighs> get back here, damn it! <sighs> I have a feeling... Okay. Also, it teared me up a little bit. I'm not gonna lie when he said maybe I just wanted one last fight. Because in every game, they're always fighting. <sighs> but back to the issue at hand, I think the Seryu clan, Ebina, have leaked more pictures and things of Kiryu, and now they know who he is. Even though they leaked it a few days before, I think now people actually are finally seeing it. I don't think anything new is on the Sataro channel, because she's not doing it anymore. Oh, are those Hitman? Are they about to... Yep. I th that might be it. Oh, wait, no. What's up, people?
people, Tatara Channel coming at ya! As always, we're out to boldly reveal the evils the media is just too scared to touch! Let's jump into today's topic! Now look here! Everyone knows this face, right? That's right! Photographed in Hawaii just the other Wait, day, it's Wait, how did the Kiryu. person who's filming this, this walk up to the window without them seeing right it? right here in Japan, in our own backyard! And the people that outside, too. That means Kiryu's come home. And why, you ask? Well, feast your eyes. Also, I take it Ebena is using this a voice is modulator for the Taro. This the biggest Yakuza groups of all time. The Tojo clan's sixth chairman, Daigo Dojima. And that's not all. With him are Tojo clan officers Goro Majima and Taiga Saijima. These are all major players. Yakuza all-stars, if you will. How about our longtime viewers? I'm sure they recognize these guys, right? Yep, these are the guys who ran that security company from Sotenbori. The same one yours truly covered a while back. A wicked security firm run by former Yakuza members, the company was dissolved shortly after we featured them on our channel. At first, we thought they had well disappeared, but it seems they've simply been hiding out. Now, what's this mean for Kazuma Kiryu? Why would he visit them now of all times? To find out, we've invited the man who risked his very life to bring us this footage. Is it the truck driver? Ah, yes. Hello there. Uh, now, of course. Now, right away, if you don't mind telling us, sir, just how did you end up with this video? Well, I'm a truck driver, you see, and yesterday I picked up this hitchhiker. I didn't know the guy was Kazuma Kiryu at the time. That said, I, I do have an eye for seeing through people. I figured he was way too fishy, so after I dropped him off, I decided to follow him. And that's when you filmed this, after you chased him down, right? So, what were Kazuma Kiryu and his Tojo clan cohorts discussing in their little shack? Did you hear what they said? From what I could hear, at least, it was stuff like going back to the Yakuza and reviving the Tojo clan. Going back to the Yakuza? Did you hear that, folks? And coming from Kazuma Kiryu and the like, does this mean everything we feared is coming true? The Yakuza really are planning their return. What does that spell for the rest of us? Take the VTuber off the screen and give me Yakuza. When did this video go up? Earlier this morning. It immediately went to number one in trending, and it's even being reported on TV. And that wasn't Chitose, was it? Nope. From what Kasuga told me, Chichan completely cut ties with Eiji after all that. Yeah, happened. voice modulator. My guess is he found a substitute. Or that. Actually, some of the more passionate fans have noticed, but only a small percentage. The channel's grown, and now even the numbers alone are drawing in more viewers. Right. And to the majority of them, it doesn't matter if they're getting the truth or not. Dwight said something similar a while back. People will always choose the flashier lie over the duller truth. Of course. There's just one thing we need to figure out then. And that's how to take the second great dissolution out of Ebina's hands. We need Daigo and the others' help. And that won't come easy. Hey, hold on a second. Check the video. There's more to it. No, please. This is something kind of odd right here. Hmm. Well now, if that's not a shock, I don't know what is. As always, folks, I'll be sure to keep you posted as soon as I hear more. On that note, our next video is a special treat. That's right, tonight I'm going live! We had some guests recently. Ebina-san and Sawashiro-san from the Seiryu Trap. Clan. Remember them? Trap. Well, as it turns out, they just offered to make an important announcement right here on my channel! I'll be visiting the Seiryu Clan offices in Tokyo up close and personal, so don't miss out! Ebina and Sawashiro? And it's tonight. We don't have much time. Plus, if it's a live stream, that means they'll actually be there. Not only that, Eiji should be there too.
All right, saying it now, 100% a trap. It's a setup. Sarashiro, I know for a fact, is not getting out of this alive. He's going to be shot. He's going to be dead. This is to set Kiryu up for even more things to basically trap everyone to a corner. There's... The Seiryu clan's Tokyo office. That's the old Tojo clan headquarters. We'd better head over there. I don't think this is going to be what you think. Give me a second. Do, 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 do. Okay. Hey, you see the tower chair this morning? That was so cool. The way she sliced into those yakuza. Seriously, she's crazy. I love her. Yeah, I guess. Huh? I thought you did too. Well, of course I do. I just don't know why she started doing all this gossip stuff. Hasn't she always? No, nah, a long time ago. She was just a chat streamer. Single digit views too. Wow, talk about jump. No kidding, but honestly, she seems like she's having a lot of fun in those old streams. She's always kept the chat happy. Huh? Anyway, I watched the stream. All, I really, all it really did was help me make up my mind. I unsubbed. I mean, it's a completely different person now, you know? What? You mean that's not her? She sounded the same to me. No way. An impression. Trust me, I know. I guess the Hisoka Tataru I knew was long gone. Wow, must suck being a true fan, huh? Yeah, I'm not into the VTuber stuff. I said that multiple times. I just find it annoying. Listen, I'll watch anime may, uh, well, every now and then. VTuber stuff, no. Sure, hmm, it's fine if you do. There's nobody here. It's a I trap! Think fans will be storming the place. Well, it's still Yakuza territory. Still, maybe not the best place to go in person. Be a pretty ballsy move, yeah? It would be. That said, what does that say about us? Ugh, what a pain. Who's that? One of my guys. I wonder what they want. It was it's a trap to get us out of what? town. Hmm? Huh. I see. Right. Thanks. It's Takabe, the Seriyu clan chairman. Someone stabbed him in his cell. Someone what? Takabe? Hey. How is he? Unresponsive and in critical condition. Ah, oh, ain't that convenient timing. Right? This has to be Ebina's doing. With him gone, the Seriyu clan can do whatever they please. And in light of that, I get the feeling they're about to try something big. <sighs> the stream starting. What's up, people? Tatara Channel coming at ya! Amazingly, this is my second stream today! What's more, tonight's show is huge! Unlike anything we've ever seen! We might even witness history in the making if we're lucky! As I announced, we're on the town tonight! More specifically, the Tokyo offices of Yakuza Titan, the Seiryu Clan. Now then, a special word from their top two. One Masataka Ebina and one Joe Sawashiro are in the building. Seems they've got a Wink, wink, not judge, you're definitely in the building. That's some fanfare. And what do you think they'll say? Looks like they're about ready, so let's give them a warm welcome. Take it away, gents. Thank you, one and all, for your time today. I'm Ebina of the Seiryu Clan. Likewise, I'm Sawashiro of the Seiryu clan. Regarding tonight's announcement, we've asked this channel for their time for but one reason. I'm sure many of you out there are feeling anxious, having heard rumors of the Tojo clan's return. As it stands, we would like to clarify the Yokohama Seiryu clan's position on the matter. And that is, we of the Seiryu vehemently oppose the revival of the Tojo clan. I see. And is this out of concern that you'll have more competition as Yakuza? No, on the contrary. It goes without saying that the Seiryu clan is a Yakuza group. Furthermore, we have been increasing our ranks as of late. However, despite these truths, we are currently planning our disbandment. Disbandment? It's already been four years, but the two largest Yakuza groups, the Tojo clan and the Omi Alliance, came together for the same purpose. Their simultaneous disbandment should still be fresh in everyone's memories. 
Regardless, as a result, many former Yakuza members flooded society, impacting public safety. And in response, former Tojo clan officers have since planned to rebuild the group. If I'm being quite frank, their attempt to disband was a failure. Being a seasoned Yakuza myself, I believe it was a colossal blow to all of us. Now, the Great Dissolution's ringleaders were Daigo Dojima, Masaru Watase, and of course, Masumi Arakawa. These three men plunged Japan into chaos, and needlessly ruined the lives of their peers. This is not an opinion. This is fact. You know, I'm sure he's only playing the part here. I wonder how much he actually believes. I guess he is putting his life on the line for Arakawa-san's legacy. At this point, it's tough to say. Uh, huh? Sawashira wasn't told about the Great Dissolution back then. He was kept out of it. I'm sure in some sense, had he been included, things might have worked out better. Maybe. Might be distorted, but his desire to help Arakawa is no less than Kasuga's. Well, it's never simple, is it? What else is new? Therefore, myself and Sawashiro here, in order to fulfill our duties as part of the Yokohama Seryu clan, now the largest Yakuza group, have developed a plan to truly disband the Yakuza once and for all. Really now? And how do you plan to do that? Right now in Japan, the five-year ex-Yakuza clause is a shackle to many. Those longing for a normal life can expect but one thing. Complete and total exile. One may as well be dead. Noble efforts aside, the previous dissolution failed to consider this. To that end, I have created a support program that will reintegrate every last member of the Yakuza back into society upon its inception. Thus would mark the second great dissolution. The disbandment of the Yakuza, in the truest sense imaginable. To aid the project, we've since begun talks with the Japanese government and hope to receive their cooperation soon. Government? Gotta say, this is a big deal. As a matter of fact, their involvement is crucial to our plan. The goal of this project, you see, is to simultaneously provide a solution to the other issue Japan's currently facing. That issue being, of course, the disposal of nuclear waste. Nuclear power plants work non-stop, producing copious amounts of waste daily. There are no proper disposal areas within Japan. As it stands, said waste has only continued to accumulate. Nevertheless, we have also procured a means to not only contain it, but also dispose of it. The answer lies with Hawaii's very own group, Palekana. Um, uh, uh, um, you're giving way too much info for this. You shouldn't years, actually say this. Palekana has contributed to both charity and environmental causes. Is he allowed As to, to the say latter, that? They even have their own disposal site, one suited for nuclear waste. Uh. After long negotiations, Palakana has agreed to take in and dispose of Japan's low concentration waste. On top of that, they have also committed to hiring former Seryu clan members following the upcoming dissolution. So you won't just solve the nuclear waste issue, but you'll help your colleagues back on their feet as well. Well, well, this really was an important announcement. Indeed. And please, let it be clear that the reason we're here is to, above all, convey the good faith of the Seryu clan. We'd like to show our sincerity that our plan is more than empty words. And in order to do so, we've decided to take that first step right here on the stream. And what would that be? But what else? As of this moment, the Yokohama Seryu clan is officially dissolved. 
You mentioned you were preparing to disband, but you meant right now? That's right. Tomorrow, we will be reborn as a new organization, a wholly legitimized non-profit. Our name? Bleach Japan. Oh, God, no. Bleach Japan? The hell is he talking about? Uh, uh, back from the dead. How do you like that? Oh, no. <gasps> that wraps it up. If this project actually goes through, could that mean a huge turning point for Japan? That's it for today's stream. Catch you at the next update. <sighs> Jerks. That was all talk. They should still be inside. Are you waiting for him? No, they might not come through here. We should go to them. I had a feeling you'd say that. All right, let's go. Every time, every time we come to this place, we have to battle through every aqua. back to dig up the old Tojo clan. Your little breakup might have been a wash, but you don't got a butt in on ours. I'm here for Ebina and Sawashiro. Out of the way. You still don't seem to understand the situation you're in. Come on. You want to embarrass yourself in front of the whole world? Says the little man in the phone. You want embarrassing? Take a look at yourself. <laughs> All right, wait. A lot of this is going to be recorded and uploaded to the internet, probably. Now we're talking. Uh, I'm just going to pancake you. Yeah, that works. Follow my lead. Hope you're ready. I'm over here. All right. No begging for mercy now. <laughs> I won't hold back. Now we're talking. Have fun with this. Goodbye. That is a really good move, bro. Follow my lead. Try and stop me. Begging for mercy now. Goodbye. I won't hold back. Hope you're ready. All right. Last wave, and we're taking inside. Now we're talking. Watch this. Nobody likes you. Let's see. Follow my lead. Try and stop me. Something else. Check this out. Let's get those wrinkles out. Watch it. Right. Yeah, let's actually finish you off. There we go. No begging for mercy now. Oh, 
I won't hold back. Alright, just the big guy. Hope you're ready. You're weak. You're gonna be in a world of hurt. Out of my way! Now we're fine. Want Have fun with this. Follow my lead. Ariel. The Shanty Dance. Help me. Right. No begging for mercy now. I'll follow your lead. I won't hold that. Hope you're ready. Combo time. Learning more every day. Moving up, hell yeah! Yes, sweet. Woo. We should relish this. All right, moment. we got this. We're in the building. They still think's a trap. That won't budge. Looks like taking the front doors out. Over here. We'll head through the back. It's a straight shot from here. Nowhere to run. Better be ready. <laughs> Fine by me. I'm ready to kick some ass. Let's do this. Show me what you got. No begging for mercy now. I'll take you on. You're the fool. Follow my lead. Yeah, he's gonna just. Yeah, he's gone. Right. <laughs> Number. Okay. Now No move I won't hold back. Here goes nothing. Fear the full never win. There's more where this came from. Let's go another round. Let's look around for items. Empty cough, drop, can. So you finally made it. We're getting tired. We're getting tired of waiting. So no news. Ah, you don't know. I'm about ten levels higher than you. I feel bad for you. That was great. Try this on the side. You think you can win? Have fun with this. Nobody likes you. You want to fight? 
Skills of mashing. Right. The music in this area is actually kind of good. I like the beat. No begging for mercy now. Oh, Namba, you are a heavy hitter right now. I love it. Alright. Alright, you wanna do this? Here we go. Provide. Next attack's gonna hurt. Down and we got a state. Should I open it? I got 75 nice. keys. What have I been doing? Uh, Songhi, I might have gotten you your best body gear for now. Oh, ho, ho, ho. You're welcome. Also, I got a new accessory when I beat Daigo and all them. Let me see if I can find it. it might be uh Kiryu exclusive, I guess. I didn't Nope, there it is. Oh wow, that's actually really good. Okay, nice. It's basically a ribbon that gets a Melboro. Alright, we're doing this. I'm Now we're talking. I'll follow your lead. Oh, whoops. Follow my lead. Try and stop me. Try this on your side. On it. You want to fight? I'm not that down. You're going down. The old traditional. <laughs> No begging for mercy. Damn it, my weakness, gone. I won't hold that. Oh, now that's confused. There we go. Learn more every day. Hey guys, how you doing? Now we're talking. What's the hold up? Have fun with this. All right. Follow my lead. Oh wait. Nothing first. I don't think that's gonna work. It worked, yes. <laughs> Beautiful. Right. 
No begging for mercy now. I won't hold back. Get serious. I got this. Alright, he's silenced and his fire defenses went down. Just hope you're ready. Something wrong? I mean, I was going for a back attack, but that works. All yours. Follow my pretty bold. Lots of guys in here. No loser. No loser. No begging for mercy now. Have fun with this. Yep, good job, Nambo. Guys, please, my man Nambo just destroyed all of you. You shouldn't be wrong. Oh, we got one. Alright, he's gone. We should relish this moment. Oh, whoops. Ooh, that's really good. Yeah, no, that... Oh, yeah, that's actually really good. He has to be at full health, though, but still, that's really good. I think we're clear. I don't see any enemies. So it sure should be this way. Keep your eyes peeled. Yep. Mm. Little walk down memory lane, Kiryusa. Narasaki. You should really take it all in. Might be the last time you ever see it. Afraid I don't know what you mean. You're not the first person to come after me. You want my head? It'll take a lot more than you. That's some tough talk. Let's see how long you keep it up. All right, you bastards. Bring me the dragon's head. Whatever it takes. Howard won't even do it himself. Now, get him. No begging for mercy now. Huh? Have fun with this. Follow my lead. Hope you're ready. I gotcha. Right. You're weak. You're going down. You think you can win? Good old nasty ass smoke. That did not go where I wanted it to. Top of it. I won't hold back. Try to stop me. Good, that's Excalibur's small fry. I got it. 
Oh. Hey, bring it out. Wait, what is that? That's a Gatling gun. Morons. Give it here. This man is mad. No, oh, damn it. <laughs> um, you killed two of your men? You kidding me with that shit? This private army wasn't enough. He's making a mess of the place, too. I'm taking this the manor. Follow my lead. Ready. Finish him off. Of course we won. Here we go. Is this where the fun begins? Yo, sir. That is a big blade. That's a sharp blade. Oh shit, look at the size of that thing. It's swipe will split you in two. Better stay clear, yeah? Bring it on! Double the trouble! Double the play! I won't hold back. <laughs> I'm over. Wait for the knockout. There we go. He's feared. That's good. Try and stop. Oh, <laughs> thank you. This is a good spot. Right. Out of my way. Okay, she is, uh... Um... No, Hail Mary's not worth it. What's the hold up? Watch this! Follow my lead. You're weak. Nothing personal. You're all gonna pay! Oh jeez, I forgot she was the... Uh... There we go. Let's get rid of that so she can control her. Now we're All right, it's so another one. Oh, yeah, that, that hurts. Let me pop mask utility on. I want to be full health for whatever comes up. Yeah. Nice. 
Nope, missed. No Damn. Missed. I want this guy gone. Follow my lead. All right, now it's just us and you. Uh, you're not weak to that. I can do the headbutt. What yeah, why not? Nobody likes you. Oh. Ready for the My favorite move. Hope you're ready. Let's do it. I'm over here. Something wrong? Check this out. Maximum pressure. <laughs> 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 Resistant to that. Out of my way. No begging for mercy now. Let's see. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Uh oh, not good. Follow my lead. Give me a second. You know what? Nothing personal. <laughs> You're about no. to regret your life decisions and then. Oh, yeah. Have fun with this. <laughs> you can't. Oh, that's You're weak. And then. <laughs> Um, yeah, right, heal her status ailment. Good. Alright, do you have anything? No, you have nothing that will nerf him. But, he's about to hurt. I won't hold back. Let's see what we got here. Battle. It's over. Hey. You bastard. Quit wrangling and hold still. No begging for mercy now. You're going to get stopped. Let's do Watch it. this. You're on the menu. The strongest puppet mill blow I've ever done. I'm over here. You wanna fight? Check this out. You're so yeah. Hey, everyone. <laughs> Doing better than I Hell thought. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Strong. They're not gonna be in there. So. Shit! They got away! <laughs> you morons! Ebina-san and Sawashiro-san! They were never here to begin with! That live stream of theirs was a recording! Yeah! You all bought it. Just like that. Sure, we might not have gotten rid of you, but I think we'll be fine either way. Yeah! <laughs> That's right. Wait till you step outside. Kill you. Your history. Have fun running. Yeah, they recorded the entire thing in <sighs> live stream. Sounds like there's no reason to stick I, around. I, I expected Let's go. that. Yeah, good plan. You don't think they're dead, do you? Holy shit! 
Did Kiryu really do all this? Whoa. Who are these people? Do they even realize where they are? <sighs> Rubberneckers. And the media's here too. Crazy they just waltz through the front door like that. Hey! Oh, here. It's Kiryu! Hey, hey, I knew it! Kiryu did do this! I can see them! Oh, no way! Amazing! The legend busts in right as the Seiryu clans have found to disband! The absolute madman! Yep. I knew that was gonna happen. I think it's time to oh let's see what is a good save to save over it's been so long you but I'm gonna call it here I'm tired I'm very 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 tired mm, I should go to bed yeah it sounds like a good idea I haven't played this in months so I got I kind of got you know caught up in it but yeah hopefully you enjoyed this um. I still have issues with the story, but like I said, if it sticks to landing, it could end up being better than Like a Dragon. But Like a Dragon had a lot of aspects that really drew me in. This one, I'm interested, but I'm not completely drawn in yet. <sighs> the VTuber aspect, which I don't care if you like VTubers or not, I just find them personally very annoying. Not my thing. But you want to know what? I think I will do this chapter probably when I wake up. The next one I'll probably... Yeah, I think I'll do it. Holy cow, I've been playing for that many hours? Hmm. thought I'd play for longer. But yeah, uh, hopefully you enjoyed this. I'll see you next time. I'll have to change up classes next time. I'm going to change up the classes, probably put them there, basic classes, work on that. I think all their classes, except probably for Sacha, need a few more levels. I think other than that, everyone's good. But yeah, I'll see you now. Am I still Kiryu or going to Kazuga? I want to go to Kazuga so I can do the stupid island. But well, I'm sorry, I'm rambling. But yeah, I'll see you next time. And goodbye.